This video will show how to use the Digital Audio Capture app, or DAC app, for AP language tests. Students must use a district-managed Chromebook. Prior to logging in, students will navigate to Apps in the bottom left corner. Select the DAC app from the list. To launch the app, you will need three pieces of information, an activation key, your AP ID, and the item number. For now, we will use a practice login set of information. Enter the word practice, all uppercase, for the activation key. On the day of the test, this will be a mixture of letters and numbers provided by the school. Next, you will need the AP ID and exam booklet number. The item number, or bottom box, is printed on the lower right corner of the test booklet. We will use the practice example. Enter the practice number 797366. A green check mark indicates the number was accepted. The AP ID can be found on the label given to students on test day and placed on the back of the test booklet. For this practice session, enter 6YV66YX4. If an error appears because you have incorrectly entered the AP ID or item number, check and correct until you receive a green check mark for both. Click Continue once the AP ID and item number have been entered and accepted. You are now ready to begin recording. On the screen is a large record button. This will switch to pause once recording has been started. Below is a box with a timer that will count up during recording and dots that will highlight when the microphone detects audio. During the test, the proctor will instruct students to click record and say their AP ID. Watch to see the timer counts up when recording is in progress. My AP ID is 6YV66YX4. Click pause after you finish recording the AP ID. After clicking pause, the app opens the audio recording check screen. Students are instructed to listen to the recording. Students must click play and confirm their microphone and app are working. The continue and re-record options are available only after students click play. If you cannot hear or understand the recording, inform the proctor. You can use the re-record option to try again. Students should listen to the full recording to ensure the AP ID was recorded. If the recording is clear, click Continue. At this point during the actual test, the proctor will start the master CD. Students will only click pause and begin recording when instructed by the CD. During the conversation, students will not pause. You will record both sides of the conversation, what is played over the speakers from the CD and your conversation response. On the test day, students will click pause to pause or resume recording as directed by the CD. 
Students will be instructed to pause and resume recording several times until both of the free response options have been completed. The button does not change and always displays pause. When recording is in progress, the box on the screen will display recording and the timer will count up. When the recording is paused, the box displays paused and the timer is stopped. While the recording is paused, students have the option to stop recording. Students click stop only when the CD gives the instruction to stop at the end of all recording tasks. After clicking stop, students are prompted to confirm they have completed recording all responses. If a student clicks stop before recording is complete, they must select no from the pop-up box to continue recording. Once you have finished all recording tasks and have been instructed to click stop, you may continue and select yes. The audio recording check screen appears again after students have selected yes on the stop recording message. Students are instructed to click play and listen to brief portions of their recording to confirm that both responses were recorded. Continue becomes active after students click play. My AP ID 4. During the conversation, students will not stop recording as directed by the school district. If the recording is complete, students should select continue. If the recording cannot be heard, students are instructed to raise their hand. After students have selected continue, the recorded file uploads directly to the DAS portal and a success message appears. The file is also automatically deleted from the Chromebook. Students then click done. The app returns to the activate AP testing screen and students may be dismissed. If any student receives an upload error message, they should inform the proctor immediately. Students can long press the power button to sign out or power off the Chromebook.